In this video, we will see how to texture the road and curbs. Select the ground object, go to modifiers tab and apply all modifiers. Hide the ground object, select the road, go to edit mode and then switch to UV editing. Select half of the main road. Place your cursor in the UV editing window and press U. In case you see a drop down menu, select unwrap option. Make sure to be in edge selection mode in the UV mapping window. Select one vertical edge of any quad, press S, X0. Do the same with the other vertical edge. For horizontal edges, press S Y0. Select the whole quad and press U while keeping the cursor in the layout window, and select follow active quads from the drop down. Change edge length mode to even and press OK. Go to materials section, add a material and name it road. Click on the circle beside the base color and select image texture from the options. Click open and select your road texture. Press A to select all quads in the UV editing window. Scale and resize the UV map and adjust it according to the road texture. Select the other half of the racetrack and follow the same procedure. If your texture has white marks at the sides, you would like to remove them at the intersections. To do so, select the face at the intersection. Place the cursor in the UV editing window and press A, then period key from the number pad. Select one of the vertical sides, and move them on the X axis and see which one removes the, the lines. Follow the same for other intersections as well. Select all faces of the main track, then select one quad from the UV editing window, press U, select follow active quads and press OK. This will make sure that the texture is aligned properly in along the track. Follow the, the same process for the intersecting roads.
you can see there is some stretching where the roads are connected to the curbs. Select the edges joining the road and curbs, press N, and increase the value of mean crease, which comes under item menu. Follow the same process of texturing. Increase mean crease value of the edges at the intersections if you see that the texture is getting curved. Here the curbs were not following the ground height, so I snapped the vertices to the ground. To texture the curbs, select the required faces, assign a new material to them, unwrap them, straighten the vertical edges of any one quad by pressing SX0, and then SY0 for horizontal edges, select the quad that you modified, then press U, follow active quads, OK. Press A to select all quads in the UV editing window, and scale them according to your texture. If you found this video helpful, please like, share, and subscribe. In the next part we will see how to make the surrounding ground and texture it.